Hey traders, Jake from Optimist Futures here, bringing you a new video. And in this tutorial, we'll be covering one of TradingView's new features. It's the ability to apply templates to several same type drawing tools at once. Now, this is for you traders out there who utilize TradingView's drawing tools, use the same one multiple times throughout the day, and have a preset selection of settings that you like that you want to use repeatedly. So for example, if you often draw trend lines and you have a specific preference of trend line, for example, you wanted a blue trend line with a certain thickness and a certain style of line. Now you could save that as a template. So when you go to redraw that tool again, rather than having to reconfigure your same exact drawing tool for the same settings over and over again, you could simply just choose a template, apply it and efficiently use the same settings from one tool to the other. So it's really easy to do this. All you need to do is select the drawing tool of your choice. For example, here, I'll select an arrow. There's no true rhyme or reason to why I'm selecting this. I just want to choose a really easy tool to display this with. From here, I need to select my color settings. You can do that by clicking the pencil icon, choose your color for this line or arrow, whatever the drawing tool is. Then you could choose the thickness of your line. And then whether you want it line, dash or dotted, Feel free to customize your other settings as needed. And once you have it the way you like, come to this new feature here. It's called templates. You'll see it looks like three squares with a plus. And then go ahead and save drawing template as. Now, feel free to name this uh, as however you need. So we can name this line purple. Once I save it, the next time I draw an arrow in this case, if I want to reapply this template now under my list, I'll see the exact template I just created called line purple. So I can go ahead and select that. Now this one I had selected already preset to that. So let's go ahead and set it back to the default. Here's a new option as well. As you can see, there's the ability to apply default drawing template. So if I go ahead and do that, you'll see this arrow changes to trading views default. Now, if I want to set it to my customized preset, I just click on it. Again, click the template menu, choose my template that I created. Again, I named it line purple, apply it. And there we go. It has the same exact settings I just configured. Let's do that one more time down here in a blank area of my chart, just so you can see it clearly. This time I'll choose a ray. So I want to choose my ray, draw it, configure my settings. Again, choose whatever color scheme you want, the thickness of the line, and then whether you want it line, dash, or dotted. Once you have it set up the way you liked, go ahead, click on the template menu. Now you won't see the ones I've done previously because those were just for arrows. So this time for my ray, I need to select a new template name. I can name it orange ray. And again, name this whatever you'd like. Then again, I'm gonna set this back to default just for the sake of this video. As you can see, it just turned blue, it's solid. I come up to my templates menu, apply orange ray, and there we go. I have my template that I just saved a couple seconds ago, conveniently available for me. So now when I draw multiple rays, if for whatever reason the default doesn't pull up your existing settings, just come to your template menu, choose the selection that you created previously, and lock it in, and there you go. I have the same exact template, the same exact drawing style and different tools I used um, all in unison across the different tools on TradingView. So we hope this video helps a really simple yet effective feature that hasn't been available until now. So feel free to utilize this if you are utilizing TradingView's drawing tools. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comment section below, or we'd also encourage you to go to our community forum. That's community.optimistfutures.com and reach out and ask us any questions there. You can post screenshots, uh, links to your charts, whatever you need. Thanks for watching the video and we hope this helped.